Prince Harry has recalled having a heated sit-down with Prince William, his late grandmother the Queen, and the then Prince of Wales, his father King Charles. Picking up on Harry's nonverbal clues, body language expert Darren Stanton believes the Duke still holds on to anger and frustration over the meeting. The tense family summit at Sandringham was raised by the Duke in episode 5 of the bombshell Netflix series Meghan and Harry which dropped on Thursday. Speaking on behalf of Betfair Bingo, Mr. Stanton said, at one point in the documentary, Harry is seen speaking about a tense meeting with William, Charles and the Queen. Harry flashed an apparent expression of anger. It's clear he still holds a lot of frustration and anger when he thinks back to the situation. He then rubbed his right hand on his knee, which is a self-reassurance gesture, before going on to speak about the Queen. His eyes were immediately drawn down and his posture shifted from an emotion of anger into sadness. Read more, Sophie Wessex wears navy coat and carries clutch bag with a snick on he added, Overall, Harry showed a combination of stress and anger in the clip. It's clear he wanted to leave his royal duties, but also wanted to remain loyal to the Queen and to his father. He was being pulled in two directions and trying to do his best for his family. From his face, Harry is not a man that can hide stress or worry very well. I believe he has been deeply affected by the whole situation. Episode 5 sees Harry provide details of an alleged row during a family summit sparked by friction over his and Meghan's plans for their future. He said, it became very clear very quickly that that goal wasn't up for discussion or debate. It was terrifying to have my brother scream and shout at me and my father say things that simply weren't true. And my grandmother, you know, quietly sit there and sort of take it all in. The same episode sees Harry claim the meeting had been timed able to exclude Meghan who had left the UK to look after baby Archie, so he had to attend alone. Harry says, I went in with the same proposal we had already made publicly. But once I got there, I was given five options. One being all in, no change. Five being, all out. I chose option three in the meeting. Half in, half out. Have our own jobs, but also work in support of the Queen.